Yo, 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 what up, though? This your boy Elza representing Detroit, Michigan. And yo, I'm hip hop officials, artists of the week. It's like that, baby. What up, Pam? How your little man doing in New Jersey? Last I heard, he caught the flu and you was worried. Hope he feels better. And thanks, Jonetta from Cleveland, for that good thing your Jetta better believe it. I represent one half of Slum Village. My name is Elza the Magnificent crazy rhyme writer you know what i'm saying what i do is just uh give everybody the best lyrical experience as possible represent detroit you know how we do 313 you know we bringing back that old motown era you know what i'm saying when when it when it felt good and to do the music and we've been doing things for years man you know what i'm saying black milk been doing this thing for years guilty simpson you know proof and dj head and you know what i'm saying shout outs to jay dilla rest in peace i mean we just carrying on a tradition man that they done laid out for us and uh, just making sure, you know, we give you that classic music like back in the Motown era. Detroit got its own different kind of hip hop. It, it, it I, I think it spring from like, you know, just the environments being the way that they are. It's kind of like you got beautiful settings, but then at the same time, it's kind of grimy. So when you hear slum, you know what I'm saying? You might hear like beautiful music, but the words that we talking about and the things and the content that's coming out our mouth through verses, you know, may represent the grime side of Detroit, you know what I'm saying? So we got that nice little contrast where it's rough, but yet it's still pretty. Slow now stuffed animals on a tree, froze from a stray bullet. Though it bear no name, when the whistle through the air prepared for aim. What can make a man cock and squeeze on the block with I'm more like a wordsmith, you know what I'm saying? Like, I do patterns, I do styles. See, I'm, I get more off into the writing. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people, they don't they don't really look at the writing anymore. You know what I'm saying? They look at what they beat can do for them or what they hook can do for them. Me, I, I straight up rely on the writing. And it, and it basically sprouted from me, you know, back in the day. Like, I mean, I sh I've been listening to hip hop since 85, you know what I'm saying? So I done went through a lot of changes from the gimmick stages and all that. And, and looking at cats like Lord Finesse, I was like, man, you know, I like how he can do him. I mean, he ain't even doing no gimmicks, but he's still ill like that. You know what I'm saying? So I was like, man, I, I need I need to take it to that level where people feeling me off of the writing. So basically, I just take the writing to a whole nother level. You know what I'm saying? Bottom line, you're not gonna get what I'm gonna give from anybody else. It never be another cat like Dilla. You know, Dilla influenced so many people, man, from from the Neptunes to, you know, Ninth One, even Dr. Dre. On a for real, for real, he gave me my first check in the game, you know, which was a G. And I would have framed it, but you know, at the time I was doing bad. And I was like, nah, I can't, nah, I gotta spend this, but. Dude, first cat to ever pay me, man. Just the way that he took chances on the music, you know what I'm saying, and did it his way. I think everybody need to follow in his footsteps. You know what I'm saying? Cause to him, it wasn't all about the glamour and glitz. That's why, you know, a lot of people be like, man, don't nobody really know about Dilla. Well, Dilla was kind of in the background. He ain't really, you know, he ain't really try to be all up in the front like how producers do today. You know what I'm saying? So it was just basically all about the music for him and touching people, you know, on a creative level. Like I said, never be another cat like that. And, you know, we just gonna, we just gonna end it like that, man. To get more hip-hop official on your phone, text HHO to 44688.